What's up ladies and gentlemen, for the longest time people simply could not get the design down for the selfie stick. You see guys, this thing really kicked off last year and everyone was like, yo, Instagram's kicking off, let me go ahead and take a billion selfies, upload them to my Instagram after taking 10 million, which are probably still in people's camera rolls, and the whole selfie thing was just like a revolution, you'll see that in like history books and things. But my point is, to have a proper selfie you need like a little bit of distance, your arm doesn't want to be in the shot, and all that other good stuff, go ahead and search up how to take a proper selfie on YouTube, the videos are priceless. But, my point is that with the selfie stick, it just makes a life, well, life a lot easier. Especially if you're trying to get a group selfie in, or say you're trying, say you're not trying to take a selfie. Say you're just trying to get a video in of you trying to, like, skateboard from your perspective. Well, nonetheless, selfie sticks are pretty important. But the design was never there. The design was terrible. Sometimes they were too bulky to fit into your pockets. Sometimes it didn't have a wrist strap. Sometimes the buttons would break. Uh, they wouldn't hold your phone, so your phone would fall off and smash to bits. But I feel like this particular selfie stick got the design down. Now here's why I say this. This thing is small enough to fit into your pocket, which is really convenient. It folds up to the point where it could be a really mini selfie stick as well. It has this cool little button right here which you hold down and it connects to your phone via, via Bluetooth. Now some of the selfie sticks that I tested earlier had this separate button that you would either lose or wouldn't connect to Bluetooth or the battery would run out. None of the problems here, it's built in and if you're looking to charge this thing, there's a cool little charging input right here. It has a nice rubber grip so you're going to have that stellar grip, you're not going to accidentally drop your selfie stick aka your phone. And and another cool thing is the cool little clamp right here. As you guys can see, you can go ahead and extend as far as you need. I believe this can fit most phones out there. Okay, so you're like, wait a minute, this is really small. How the heck am I supposed to take a proper selfie with that thing? Well, this is where things get really cool. You simply pull this and it just extends and extends and extends and extends until it's more than long enough for a pretty stellar group picture or a pretty, well, a nice selfie with a nice background. It also has a cool little wrist strap as well, so basically, I feel like this is the default design right here. This, a button built right in, a battery built right in, a clamp that's not going to make your phone go flying, and of course, an extendable arm. And nothing else is needed for the perfect selfie, so I go ahead and give this selfie stick a 10 out of 10. And I don't know what else you can say inside of a review for a selfie stick. Build quality, amazing. It has a nice rubberized grip. Everything feels smooth. Nothing feels like it's going to break in two days. And everything feels as premium as it gets. And the pricing is on point. So go ahead and check it out if you guys want. Link in the description below. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video on a selfie stick. You're like, what the heck did I just watch? But maybe I'm going to go buy this now. And thank you guys for watching. Leave a like. This is going to be me, logging off.